So the deal that I was given is canceled. I managed to find a replacement exhibit. So Devin, what inspired you to create an exhibit of popcorn? Oh, you know, I just wanted to work with edible art. Swirly popcorn art. Doesn't feel kind of gimmicky to you? Well, I wouldn't let Devin Cole here say that. Which one is he? I don't think I got your name. Showtime. Bye. Oh, he's cute. You should have seen him. He was leading me on. Maybe he was, you know, flirting. Hello again? Hi. Claire, devote 110% of your time to make Devin's exhibit a success. So what is your idea for this record-breaking exhibit that we've hired you for? Hmm? You'll be the first to know. You don't have any ideas. You don't understand the creative process. He doesn't have any ideas for the exhibit. Don't judge Devin too quickly. You don't know what you think of more in common. What we have in common is an exhibit that needs to open in two weeks. Shoes. Shoes. If ice cubes and popcorn can be art, then why not shoes? They come with headphones and an audio guide. And the visitors will come in, they'll try on the shoes, and you hear about that person's life. You brought out the big gun. Yeah, well, it is an important meeting. How are my shoes? Let's go for it. Yes. yes. I knew your two different skill sets would make a terrific team. You knew. What if some of the stories we included for the exhibit were people I pass on my way to work every day? Thank you. Hi, I'm Claire. Emma is a budding reporter. How would you like to interview all the people who are going to be featured in the exhibit? You're staying inside the lines, right? Why don't we take tomorrow off? We should celebrate. New York, that's the next stop. It's the center of the art world. Sounds like you met your yin. My yin is waiting to hear about a commission in New York. Hey, I just got off the phone with New York. You got the commission. Congratulations. This is amazing. Good job, we're here. He did leave you a parting gift. He wanted you to have these. Not going to New York, Claire. Sounds like he's not a very special woman. <laughs>